Hello, this is Cute Fuzzy Weasel, or Cute Fuzzy Weasel's hands, and welcome to another Weasel Draws. Today, I'm going to take a time out from user submissions to do a little bit of a tribute fan art to a guy I follow on YouTube. His name is The Dishonored Wolf, and uh, recently he had to essentially rebuild his entire channel. So I'm kind of doing this as sort of a shout out, you guys. Go down, links, links right there. Check out his channel. I think he's very talented. He could really, you know, use the support right now. So give him a, give him a look at. Uh, he does primarily gaming stuff and rants, and his shtick is he has this uh, wolf character, uh, which he animates. Not, not like, like. Don Bluth kind of like full animation. No, it, it, you know, it shifts position around. Like you see a lot of YouTubers do that. Um, kind of the same vein as uh, the Armored Skeptic or... Uh, ah, shit. Who else does it? There's this other guy who does it, but I'm not real sure. Anyway, uh, I'm going to go ahead and try my hand at drawing that. Hit this link down here if you wanted to skip to the end and see the 10 second time lapse. And uh, let's go ahead and get this started. So what I'm thinking for the character is, uh, huh, maybe, maybe sitting. Yeah, I haven't done any kind of chairs. Like, I've never, not really done furniture, so. This show is as much about, you know, me practicing as anything else. It's more or less just recording practice. Uh, yeah, make it a, kind of a lazy boy thing. We'll put a handle there. Just quick. But yeah, I, I, I'm not real... Objects is something that I, I don't... I don't get to draw that often anymore. I'm really very, very oppressively busy. As we all are in this game of bullshit that some people, I'm kidding, I'm not going to call life bullshit. That would be gay. Anyway, uh, yeah, chair. Um, it's kind of a slouch. He's mostly, like, angry. It, it, the, the, the personality of the guy, not, I'm sure not his actual personality, although I don't know. The character personality is kind of a, belligerent trunk of um loudmouth kind of narcissism narcissistic ah i've had a few today today's been a long day and i i had a few Just had a few all right five is not a few five is a lot yeah, I've gotten better about holding my alcohol. I remember back a couple of years ago, you know, it, shit. It used to be, um, that, you know, one or two beers could do it, but, you know, through the magic of genetic engineering, I've been able to augment my liver, um, uh, anyway, getting kind of a slouching thing from him. Uh, actually, this, this looks too much like he's listing to one side. I want to make sure that he's kind of symmetrical. Alright. So what I'm going to do is, is he's going to be going like, what? You know, like angry. I'm going to have my arms here. Oh, you know what? Maybe instead of this, I'll have him leaning forward. Yeah. I have him leaning forward. And this is all basic line work right now. I'll expand upon it um, once I get the the basic the ba the basic body plan down and then I'll expand on it. Um so it'd be like you know, what the hell? Yeah. You know, Um, hands. I still kind of fuck up hands a bit. My apologies, Dishonored Wolf, if this drawing looks fucked up at all. I'm kind of out of practice. Again, that's the point of the show. 
minutes practice. Um, all right, so that's basically what we're going for for the uh, for the body plan. He's going to be sitting down in this chair. Gonna have his hands kind of like this. All right, so let's go for the head. Uh, and again, I'm still trying to find a good position for the camera for these. Um, <laughs> right now, I'm looking at the paper this way, trying to draw it this way because the camera's, you know looking down here. So I will periodically shift it over just to make sure I'm getting it right. Yeah. Ah, here it is. There's my good one. Yeah, speaking of erasers, I find that the uh, fiber, uh, fabric castle, fiber castle, this one, really, really good. Let's see if it'll focus on that. Oh, I guess not, but this, really fantastic. Fantastic eraser. Take check this out. Look at that. Beautiful. Okay. Fucking dogs. Ah, goddamn neighbors probably lighting another friggin' person on fire. They do that here. Especially since it's purge night. That's why I'm not outside. I killed enough people. There's this... Uh, I saw a trailer for a kind of a, a comedy version of The Purge. It, it's, it's, I think it's done by the same guys who made the uh, scary movie. The, the latter scary movies. Not the first couple of good ones. I think Scary Movie 1 and 2 were pretty good. Scary Movie 2 especially was very good. Uh, scary Movie 1. 1. Scary Movie 1. Not Scary Movie 2. See, my, my fear is that I'm going to make him wolf -like, uh, fox-like. And I don't need him to be fox-like. He's not a, a fox. Here, put them in there. Always a challenge trying to keep the pencils sharp. But I tell you, going... Going about drawing the line work first with a uh, light blue, I don't know what it is, but it's helped my my drawing out immensely. I, I, I don't know why drafting pencils like this, and this is kind of a drafting pencil. It's a Prismacolor color erase. It's not exactly a drafting pencil, uh, because most drafting pencils, as I understand, don't have erasers. But it's used a lot. I mean, I I have a friend who's a drafter and he uses these kinds of things. When he's not using a tablet, a lot of this stuff is not done on paper now. All right, get this. Kind of going for a cartoony look because I suck. Ah, fucking Christ. God damn it. Yeah. So we're getting, kind of get in the face here. Yeah. Though right now he's really kind of like a kangaroo. We'll change that. Oh, tail. I'll have the tail kind of doing this. Again, I want to try to avoid making him look too much like a fox. That's very easy to do when you're drawing a wolf for some reason. I think, you know, they're both canines or whatever. Yeah, a fox is a canine. Oh, right. I guess I have to figure out what he's wearing. Uh, seems like the leather jacket kind of guy. Yeah. Well, most of the characters I draw, they always have jackets on. Yeah. Luckily, there's a leather jacket, actually, hanging up over there. So I can just look over my shoulder. Still, this is unbelievable progress from where I was last February. When I actually started getting back into drawing, jeez, unbelievable. Much better now. Um, yeah, we'll keep them without shoes. Kind of give him a baggy kind of pants. Yeah. 
There we go. There we go. Up. And round. And this will be chair. Yeah. Okay. Shut up, dog. It's just the neighbors out there beating someone to death again. I don't know why they do that. It's kind of a family tradition for them, apparently. They go out, find a random person, take them back to the house, beat them to death, and then, you know, drag their body around the next day. It's the South. Hands. My mortal enemy. Never been good at them. Never, ever been good at them. Occasionally I get lucky and the right kind of combination shows up and I'm able to draw them, but most of the time, like this. Ah, the alcohol is not helping. Alcohol is definitely not helping right now. Yeah. Yeah, speaking of Sir Skeptolot, maybe I'll draw him next. You know. Most of the time, though, when people tell me about my hands, I just tell them, yeah, it's my style. I find that saying, yeah, it's my style, is a great way of masking. Like, it's better than saying, yeah, I suck. No, they're, they're, uh, they're stylized. Yeah. They're stylized, George. They're stylized, George. I don't know, voice in my head. I don't think Jar Jar's a really good character. Nonsense, George! Jar Jar's gonna be great, George! Are you sure? Wait, where the fuck am I going with this? God damn. Ah. There we go. Ah. Uh, you know what? That's pretty good. Just basic lines. Real basic. Um, that's what I'm going to go for. Okay. This has been QFuzzy Weasel. If you like this video, like, comment, subscribe, share to your friends, tell everybody, uh, worship me as a god. <laughs> I'm kidding. Don't do that. I had that happen once before. Anyway, this is QFuzzy Weasel. And remember, check out Dishonored Wolf channel down below. And as always, have a good day.